Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So we have another weekly vlog today. Um, it is currently Monday morning. Um, yeah. We are just chilling out. I've just had breakfast. Archie's down having a play on his Mac. He's so grumpy today. Oh my God. Last night he woke up, I think about six times. He woke up so much. Um, he, I think he goes to sleep too early. I'm not too sure. Like he goes to sleep around like 6, 6.30. He used to go to sleep at around 7, 7.30, but then daylight savings happened. And so now he goes to sleep at six and I haven't been able to keep him up because he keeps falling asleep or he'll get really, really chitchy and grumpy. Um, so, yes, it has been a little bit more difficult since daylight savings has started. He's just been a bit more grumpy because his sleep's gone really weird. I don't know what's going on, but what is it? He's currently fighting with a giraffe down there. I think he's tired. But yeah, I'm going to do some research today on... Trying to hold him with my like Yeah, I'm going to do some research today and like... Just see... No, that's not your toy, Pippa. Um, I'm going to do some research today to see like how I can help his sleep. Because yeah, once it hits like 2 in the morning, like he'll wake up... He wakes up at like... He goes to bed at yeah, like 6, 6.30. I'm going to put my camera up because the sleep won't go. So his first um, wake up will be about yeah, 10.30 or 11. So he'll feed then. Um, I used to dream feed but I stopped. But I think I'm actually going to go back to dream feeding because I feel like it worked a little bit better. Um, and then, yeah, he wakes up at about 1.32 again. And then since 2 o'clock, for the past like week or so, Ever since it hits 2 o'clock, he'll wake up every hour and it's just, oh my god. So I think I need to keep him up for a little bit longer at night, but I'm just not too sure how to do that. I'm just trying to figure this whole thing out. It's quite difficult. Um, but yeah, so we have had no sleep today, so mum is having a double shot um, coffee today. And then we might have an energy drink later on. Anyway, enough of that baby sleep um i didn't do a weekly vlog last week i filmed a couple of days i think but i started it on wednesday and then honestly just didn't film anything um yeah didn't really do too much last week same old thing that i do every week so yeah um i hope everybody is doing well at home or if you're at work hope you're keeping safe and yeah what are we doing today mr man are you gonna let me do anything well, you're going to be grumpy, boys. Going to be grumpy? Probably. Um, yeah, I think today I'll just try and get things done. I want to make a list of videos. I've lost all my inspiration for, like, other videos to do other than vlogs. I need to, like, just make a list of videos that I want to film because there are a few that I want to film. Um, so, yeah, I need to write all that down today. Um, what else am I going to do? Oh, I need a vacuum so bad, so we'll vacuum. And then, yeah, washing probably. Just errandy things around the house. These carriers are honestly the best things ever. He wants to be held for ages, but also, like, he's quite heavy now, so these are, like, the best things. This one here is a little carrier from Baby Born, and I absolutely love it so good he'll usually fall asleep in this as well i think he's just overtired what are you doing are you chewing on that but yeah he's, he's overtired at the moment so like i can't put him down he won't eat anything he's already eaten a bottle um so this will probably rock him to sleep but then you got to get him out of it and put him in his bed can't win <laughs> Hey guys, all right, so it is now Friday. I have been a terrible vlogger this week. I think I've only like introed the vlog, I'm not too sure. But yeah, it's Friday now, so this will most likely be more of like a weekend vlog. Um, I've gone to vlog this week and like things have just happened. Either actually it's been a little bit fussy or like I just haven't been in the mood. Um, so yeah, that's why I haven't vlogged much um and like not much is going on you know we're all in like quarantine or self-isolation at the moment and there's just not a whole lot to vlog about really this is basically what i look like majority of the time and i'm usually either tending to my baby or i am watching 
YouTube or cleaning my house. Maybe I should just film more of cleaning my house because I do that a lot. Um, I like to chuck on like a cleaning video. Um, I've been watching Alexandria, Alexandra Beauty. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. I'm not sure. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I've been watching her videos lately, and um, yeah, I love her like cleaning videos. They make me really like motivated to clean. So I just kind of put those on while I'm doing something around the house. Um, so yeah, maybe I should just film more of that. But yeah, you anyway, know, today it is Friday. Um, Archie's down there i feel like whenever i show you guys he's down there but honestly he's either down there he's starting to sit up a little bit now so sometimes i'll sit him up on the couch as well um but yeah he's in his little cloud down there he's been super fussy this morning honestly we what's wrong it's all right yeah he's been so fussy he wakes up at like three in the morning and doesn't go back to sleep for about an hour so we put him in our bed we'll feed him and then sometimes we just fall, fall asleep um, while he's in the bed. So he'll kind of just sleep in there. And I hate it. I didn't want to co-sleep at all. Um, I don't know. That was just it was just something that I didn't want to do. I wanted him to be sleeping in his own bed. But he's honestly so fussy. And he's um, growing out his Moses basket already. So I'm not too sure what to do. I'm, too, I'm scared to leave him in his room by himself. Because I'm already a warrior. Like I already wake up every time I hear a noise from him so um I think with him in his room I'll just be a little bit more freaked out but yeah I don't know whether to get a new bassinet or whether I get like a travel cot and put him in that but I've heard that they're not good for um like sleeping for over a week in so I don't know I don't know what to do um but yeah we're losing a lot of sleep at the moment today I am going to what do I want to do I want to move that shelf over there there that one there and put it in the corner here there used to be the cube storage there but i'll remove the cube storage over here so i want to put it there um and then um move the table out a little bit i might do that when ollie gets home so he can watch or maybe when archie's gone to sleep i don't know um but yeah i want to do that i want to i need to do the dishes i've got quite a few dishes i've been doing baking i've made two lots of brownies the first brownies turned out like crap because I put 25 grams of butter in instead of 125 grams and I was wondering what the hell was wrong with them so yeah they were crap but made a second batch and those ones were good um and what else but yeah I don't know what else I'm gonna do I kind of want to film but then I'm also like mm, I would just wait for Ola to come like be here on the weekend I need to get out of that mind frame though because I'm not getting any videos done I filmed my nighttime skincare routine but um the lighting in my bathroom is so shit so i want to refilm it and um just film it in my room instead um yeah i kind of wanted it to be more lifelike like what i actually do and i'm actually in the bathroom when i do my skincare routine but um yeah no super random but i picked this up from the supermarket last night i went to the grocery shop um and i got these i love sparkling water um, so I thought I would try these. I've heard these are really good. I actually want to try it LaCroix. I've tried it once before, but um, yeah, I haven't been able to find them in Sydney. There's only one shop in Sydney that sells LaCroix and it is in Redfern. And right now I have no need to go out to Redfern. So um, yeah, I decided to try these. I've actually heard someone tell me that they were like nicer as well, but I don't know. I have nothing really to base it off. I've only tried LaCroix once. It's got a little bit more flavour than LaCroix which is what I like um, but not too much. I don't like it to the point where it tastes like soda because I don't like fizzy drinks. I loved Coke when I was pregnant but that's about it. I don't really drink a whole lot of fizzy drink but I love sparkling water so I grabbed a box of these and I freaking love them. So good. This is the lemon lime flavour. Flavor, flavor. <laughs> Next time I think I want to try the the berry one there's a mixed berry flavor too but yeah super good kind of random hey baby he's so big now he's getting so big he um is almost some of his um zero to three month clothes are getting a little bit small this one here is a little bit tight when i do it up so we kind of just leave it like a t-shirt at the moment but yeah, he's getting so big so fast. I understand now why mums say cherish the newborn stage because 
they are tiny for not long at all like he has grown so fast and I just feel like it came out of nowhere um, and my camera's running out of battery damn it um, but yeah he's doing good though he's growing hey he's got super long nails which is why he's got little cuts on his face um, I need to cut his nails but it kind of freaks me out hey you're a happy boy now aren't you he loves this one, he just stares at this one for ages. <laughs> I'm here and I have makeup on. I feel like a human again. Um, I actually went down for a nap quite a while ago now actually. Um, so I thought I would quickly chuck some makeup on and if he stays asleep I might um, film a video. I need to film my favourites video, I wanted to do one every month this year, but honestly like February and March I wasn't really wearing a whole lot of like makeup, it was more like mum things that would have been my favourites and I want to do, if you guys want to see it, I don't know if you guys want to see like mum related videos on this channel but I was thinking about doing like a newborn essentials video, let me know if you would be interested in seeing that um, I don't want to film it if nobody's interested um, but yeah, most of my favourites would have been like baby things and mum things. Um, whereas now I've been getting a little bit more into makeup and looking after myself a bit more. Um, now that like I've learnt to manage my time a little bit better. So yeah, I've got a few more favourites and I've been trying out a bunch of new things that I'm excited to share with you guys. So I've got quite a few favourites so that's why I want to film a favourites video. What am I bab- oh, I see I always do this, I bab on for way too long and nobody cares. Um, but anyway, enough about that. I want to film a favourite video anyway, if he stays asleep long enough. But I'm just about to make some lunch because I am hungry. Um, it is currently, what's the time? 2.23. He's usually awake by now. I put him down for a sleep in his nursery. Um, and he slept in there before, well not like slept, he's like literally had like a 10 minute nap in there before. Um, but I've been trying to get him used to being in there because I want him to start taking his day naps in there because his, like I said before, his bassinet just, he's outgrowing it so fast. Like he still fits in it but when he moves he kind of like knocks the sides and the ends and stuff like that. So yeah, he's gone down for a really good amount of time. It took me about three times to try and get him to sleep though. Um, so yeah, he's gone down out. But I'm going to make some lunch. I think I'm going to do like a chicken salad. I might put it in the same way, try it on. But we got um, a cooked chicken from the supermarket last night. And I'm going to heat up. I'm going to have that for lunch. So I'm just going to break up some of this. If you don't like watching people play around with meat, skip this part. That is lunch, just a bit of chicken, stuffing, and mayo, and a couple of brioche buns. Yum! Okay, so I just had a little freak out. I thought my camera was broken. No, I did something really weird. But anyway, I have just finished filming. I filmed my favorites video. Yay! I can't believe that Archie is still asleep. It's 3.30. I'm pretty sure I put him down at like 1, just after 1. And he's still asleep. He never sleeps for this long, which is crazy. He, mind you, he was up so much last night like he was up pretty much like I don't think he slept like a lot at all because we had him in between us and he just kept waking up which is why we had him in between it's crazy so I'm gonna go put all this stuff away I thought he would be awake by now but he's not I'm gonna go put all this stuff away and then maybe do some washing get some housework done until he wakes up I'll probably wake him up I don't want to let him sleep over three hours or two and a half I do I'd say he went down at like 1.30, so he's been asleep, been asleep for around two hours now, so I might wake him up in like half an hour if he's not awake, so yeah. 
I feel bad waking up. Maybe I should just let them sleep. Do you guys wake your babies up if they sleep like for too long or do you just leave them sleeping? I don't know what to do. I don't want to like ruin his nighttime routine, you know what I mean? Not that he really has one, but yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go and tidy all this stuff up. Alright, so it is now a Saturday. I have had the most chill day today. I'm literally just hung out and did nothing really. Um, but I thought I would just dye my hair. I've been wearing to dye my hair for a while now. I bought dye. I actually bought this for Allah um, not long ago, but he's not going to dye it anymore. So I thought I would use it. So I haven't dyed my hair since like the start of when I was pregnant. Um, so I thought I should dye it again. I'm going to do it um, just blue black colour. Um, I've been wanting to do blue black for a while. I have been blue black before and I actually really like it. Um, I just have to wear a lot of bronzer, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, I quite like the blue black look, so I thought, why not use this dye and dye my hair? But I find like the darkness of it usually like goes within, I think with the spider, um, it usually goes within like a couple of weeks. But then I like to buy like a um, like a toner, you can get like toners for brunette hair and it makes you, it takes away any of the brassiness out of your hair um, and it sort of like takes it back but let's do this and see how it goes I might hate it, I might love it, who knows yeah I'm using this one here from Nat Pro Palette I'm pretty sure I've used this one in my hair before whenever I usually box dye my hair because I don't Go and get my hair dyed at a hairdresser unless I'm going blonde. Um, I usually use the Garnier. What's it called? I don't know what it's called anymore. Um, I don't know, but there's this particular one that I always use. Um, it'll come to me at some point, but it's not coming to me right now. But yeah, there's this particular one that I always use in my hair. It's like a dark sort of. Um, ashy toned brown and I love it um, but let's try something different so I've got the bottle the colour the conditioner I always love the conditioner that comes with hair dye it's so good um, and then some glues so I'm just going to start off by mixing these two together and then give it a good old shake. Right, and then I'm just going to apply it in layers on my scalp and then I'll work it into the ends of my hair. You'll see as I go along. Um, I'm not going to talk through this bit. So it will take ages. But I'm just going to do it in time. And then I'm just going to go in with some of Archie's baby wipes and I'm just going to wipe around, that? around my hairline um, so that I don't stain that area. I mean it's kind of inevitable with blue black hair dye. Right, well, my neck is always the worst and my hands. For some reason like I wear gloves and stuff but it gets all over my arms and my hands and my shoulders oh my goodness this is one of my new sports bras too amazing it's all over my back that's okay not too worried about that 
yeah so now i'm going to leave that on for about 40 minutes just let it set in um, and then i'm going to wash it out so i'm going to wash it out i've been using this shampoo and conditioner here this is from monday hair care um, and it's the smooth ones i mentioned these in my um april favorites and i absolutely love them so i'm going to use that first um i might actually just use the shampoo and then um use this conditioner and, and leave it in there for a little bit my baby's crying so yeah i will come back in about an hour after i've washed it all out um and show you guys what it looks like and i think i'll blow dry my hair as well and style it just to make sure because i feel like you can't see what a hair color looks like until you style your hair so yeah i'll be back shortly all right guys so it is now monday i didn't end up showing you guys my hair after i finished it because it was so late at night and um it yeah the lighting was really bad and you couldn't even see it so i thought i'd just wait till the next day and then i didn't end up vlogging anything the next day i just like felt a little bit down on sunday um i don't know it's just like weird i'm like got nothing to be down about at all it was just one of those days you know but yeah anyway i just wanted to come on and show you guys what my hair looked like and also in this vlog because it's now next week it is monday i've just put archie down for his nap he went down for his nap real late today so hopefully he sleeps for quite a wee while so he can get some stuff done but yeah this is what my hair looks like i actually really like it i hated it when i first took it out like in the shower and stuff i just didn't like it i was like oh no like i look really bad with this hair color um but no i actually quite like it now i didn't get every bit because yeah you can still see some of the brown coming through but like yeah i feel like once i've done my makeup and like styled it a little bit more it'll look really quite nice i straightened it yesterday which is why it's like not frizzy and like it looks all right but it's just like way there at the moment because i sleep with my hair up in a bun but yeah this is what my hair looks like it's very blue you can definitely see the blue i'm watching some youtube in the background i've been really into um james welsh i think that's his name is yeah james welsh he does skincare videos he's great I've just been watching a couple of those while I was feeding Archie, but yeah. Anyway, now I'm going to go and tie my hair up, put it back in a bun. thought I'd show you guys before. I, wow, what the hell? <laughs> and this car just went past and it was like blue chrome. And it was a Toyota Yaris. I've never seen that before. <laughs> Random. Um, anyway, I'm getting super sidetracked. I'm going to go do my hair up in a little bun and I want to film a video while Archie's down. The only problem is I need to film it in the bathroom. And his room is very close to the bathroom. He's down for a nap in his room. Um, so I'm a little bit scared. I don't want to wake him up, but we'll try and be quiet. But anyway, I'm going to go. Thank you guys for watching this week's vlog. I hope you all had a great week and are having a good start to your week now. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.